What's going on YouTube? Super Ryan Games here. We're back with another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. So previously, I think we were looting a cabin. I'm not too sure. It's been a it's been a while since I played uh the story mode on this. I did play multiplayer with my brother and his friend, and I got to tell you, that was fun. So I did get a little distracted with the game. Uh, the autosave. Sure. I did get a little bit distracted with Pokemon Let's Go, and I've been live streaming that pretty much daily. And I was wondering if you guys would be interested in watching some live stream of this game. That way we can interact a little bit better. All right, I don't know what's going on here. I gotta remember what I was doing. Yeah, I guess we'll go over here with these guys and uh, talk to them. We're really far out. Let's jump on our horse and head that way. I'm like, it looks really dark, but I think it's because it's nighttime in the game. Got distracted. I'm over there reading what it says on the top of the left. So apparently, there's a lot of stuff to do in this game as far as hunting goes and gathering uh, pelts and all kinds of stuff. Different kinds of flowers and herbs and. And we just barely started scratching the surface of this game so it's gonna be a long series guys i hope you're in for it <laughs> what the heck come on horsey oh this guy what the heck let's go let's go let's go dang that, that was crazy i don't want to kill you buddy holy cow more like holy horse we're still he's still at us let's get the heck out of here I could have just killed them, but we got to be the good guys. Oh, buddy. God dang horse. Apparently that guy got butt hurt. Alrighty, alrighty, we got this, we got this, buddy. Slow it up. Missed. We got him. Let's go check it out. Well, you can like get up, boy. I thought we killed him. I can't see him. No, I don't think we got him because we don't see anything in the minimap.
Why it's so dark here? Let's go, boy. the microphone sounds good because uh, I was moving my microphone around and I decided to get another one so this one's gonna be stationary here and I won't have to change the settings around which is good oh, we got here pretty quick I think I should put the horse in that uh, hitch Corresponding increase to three. If unlock skit turns and skit stops with the horse, hold R1 plus X while moving to perform these moves. Cool. Stamina increased to six. So if you guys want me to continue a certain story, just go ahead and let me know. We're just going to go with this dude here. I think it's about hunting. Yeah, go hunting. Or, let's see. Who else is out here? The only reason I don't want to do hunting right now is because... It's very dark. Let's see, who's this? Arthur. Arthur, Dutch. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. <laughs> You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. And they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah. Dutch. Arthur. What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not strawberry. Get Your thing, boss. And Arthur? No crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't try. And my dude is all freaking full of mud. Get you. Like we're headed to Valentine. I rode as fast as I could, didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. <sighs> I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys doing? You're supposed to be scouting ahead for. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. 
Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Mike new, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Man, he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. <laughs> Forget about Mike. It was drink that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and uh, head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? Oh, uh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. <laughs> if you say so, Arthur. Here we are. Some tenderfoot drink with iron on. <laughs> Gotta park the horse or he'll leave. All right, so we made it to the saloon. Let's go to the bar, see what's going on. Which one of you mofos got Micah? Must be the bartender. Whoa, whoa, whoa I'm not even drunk yet. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple of beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I don't see a lot cool. of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Mike. A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People have been leaving me alone for the last 10 years. I'm. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. <laughs> but me and the kid here, well, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. <laughs> you did the right thing, Brian. You did the right thing. Oh, these guys are drinking more than one. <laughs> That's great, partner. Lenny, where are you? Camp. Found my friend. You know where we went? Oh, sorry. Lenny? Where is he at, Lenny? Hey, you see my friend anywhere? Must be somewhere up here. That's what I think. Hey, Lenny! <laughs> Lenny? No. Oh, wrong room. <laughs> Alright. Let's go check out the other ones. What are you doing, kid? Hello? Is he out here already? Oh, there he is. You know what? I don't know. Why ain't you never met? That's the thing, you see. Cause it. Lenny. Oh, snap. Get 
I think he's down there fighting. We'll check these rooms just in case. You don't care. I think that's him up there. Leave the kill alone, you goddamn animals. Who do you think you're talking to? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get off, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah, shut your mouth, mister. <laughs> what the hell? It's almost morning. Go. I'm trying to get in there, but I can't. Lenny! Bastard! I think it's him right here. I don't know. Damn, that ain't Lenny, he's drunk too. Contest. You're, you're a good friend to me, Arthur. Um, cheers. Cheers. Not you again. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Snap, I didn't get to push the jump button. Arthur. You alive? Arthur. Arthur. Uh, you alive, Arthur? Uh, I want to die. Where are we? What did we do? I don't know. Oh, me neither. <sighs> yeah. You pair degenerates. Oh. There's a fine for drunken violence in this town. 
You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> Either you fools got any money? It's $10 and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either you around here no more. So, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off goddamn Mikey. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just I need to take a bath. Have a little sit down. Feel sorry for myself. Oh. 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 Mission complete, a quiet time. I try to make amends with an old rival. Catch Lenny in the act. Don't get arrested. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to come back and start doing all these missions. You can rest by holding triangle. Your course will not drain while resting and will refill slightly if they ever if they're very low. Guess that fully restores my stamina. We'll, we'll try that. Yeah. Alright, so that mission was pretty cool. Let's, uh. Where's my horse? You crazy or something? There you are, buddy. see what we gotta do well I guess we'll head back to camp and try the hunting now that we um, now that it's daylight hey, what's got into your head? I look so much better during the day I need to figure out if you can actually take a bath or shower, get all this mud off my clothes. Too fast. Yep. Okay there. All right, that one for sure. We got it. One out of five horseback rabbit kills. All right, so I wasn't going crazy. There's a little uh, animal print there. Ah, 
let's take him with us. Okay, boy. So from what I heard from my friends, they're saying if you leave the animal on the horse too long, it starts to rot. So we gotta make sure to give it to the butcher ASAP. Should have pressed the R1. That's one way to get off. Alright, where is the butcher man? Hey Arthur. Good morning. Yeah. Oh, there he is. Looking for that icon. Can I talk to you a minute? Not again, Abigail. Not ever. Just leave me alone, will you? You're pathetic. You're a pathetic Could really fan, use some John good meat for this stew. Don't I know it? This should be some real good eating. Thank you, Arthur. You're welcome. Morning, Mr. Morgan. What do you got, got to offer? I guess nothing. All right, let's go talk to that hunter dude. Mr. Arthur, I told Dutch I feel I should tell you. I saw some of Combs boys riding around. Down here, what they want? I have no idea. Do they see you? I don't think so. Okay, well. Thanks for letting me know, Kieran. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ooh, looks like we can play some dominoes there. Hey, Arthur. Jose? You want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God, but you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him, let's get going. Okay, but I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses, and the stables always have the best ones. Oh, I guess you're right. This is gonna be fun, Arthur. You won't throw me? No, he's an angel, if I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Come on. Sorry, horsey. Let's get this on right, boy. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. It's a big horse. All right, let's head into town. And maybe stay out of the saloon this time. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy. Threatened to kill the whole town. 
And Davy was passed out so cold we left him there. Came back in the next day and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> uh, I'll miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spark, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. <laughs> Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Uh, he's all right. There, boy. <laughs> Yeah, that's it, boy. All right, boy. Stables are just up ahead. All right. Go sell that big fruit. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. Heck yeah, we're going to get a horse. Get to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. <laughs> Meet you back here in a bit. Hey. How can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Here, take a look. Let's see what we can find, guys. 65 dollars to sale. Let's sell it. It's a big horse, but. Let's see what else we got. Oh man, I think we've made a big mistake. Speed is three, acceleration is two. This one is the one to go with. It's got a speed of five, potential maybe eight. Or acceleration handling race standard we'll go with this one we're gonna be kind of broke oh what the heck what should we name him hmm. let's see We'll name them just like my my cat. Jupiter. So we got the slim iron stirrups. I was like, does it affect? Yeah, it does. So that increases the speed and acceleration drain rate minus 15%. I think I might go with these uh, slim line. What else can we do? Horns. This is just all aesthetics. 
blankets. You can really, like, there's so much customization here. Bed rolls. Yeah, that's it. I'm only getting stuff that'll... Help us in the long run. Oops, I didn't mean to do that, but... Kind of like the black leather. Charcoal. Oh, we can't afford it. All right, we'll go with that. We're like super broke now. All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. All right, let's see. We're full of mud. Here are your papers. And on me. A new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's going to look after you just fine. Not bad, Arthur. You happy? Well, I guess we'll see. Oh. You won't know till you get in the saddle. All right, let's get going. Uh, idiot. <laughs> we got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. Brand new horse. What's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So I guess we're going back to where we started. With you and John. Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's a code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Beautiful scenery here. Look at all them gorgeous trees. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. That's the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Cool. He gets to feed her while uh, riding the horse. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. I'll try and shoot one. 
You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I'm... I've hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes, and obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. Let's see if I can spot them and kill them without them spotting me. I don't see them. No idea where those rabbits went. And all my freaking games are like installing. Come on, boy. He staying up there? Easy now. Got it. Let's go pick it up. Pick him up, pick him up. Let's go show Jose our, our hunt. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Well, then you get us set up. I guess that's the first campfire we set up. Well, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're. Delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <sighs> Plain game. Yeah, we don't have any of the plants that we need to. change up the taste of it you want some of this? no I'm fine I don't like eating this late okay <laughs> after all that
checking to see if my heart increases my health. No, it looks about the same. All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. Arthur. You ready? Well, uh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. I could go for some coffee myself right now. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous, but we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. I tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in the mountains, Arthur. I was potent predator bait. Let's make it. Really weaned on bear meat. Just mix it together. It's not okay. too hard. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Pack up, Arthur, and let's get after him. Okay, let's go. <laughs> We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? Yeah, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen. If Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's look by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Oh! Look for tracks. Dung, bones, any sign of him. I think I found something, guys. So here, let's see what it is. Well, there's some paw marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? Okay, 
Okay, I see something else over there. Let's go check it out. Kind of reminds me of The Witcher. Wait a minute. There's something on the ground here. Half-eaten fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything out. Just here. There she is here. Watch your step. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's gotta be close. Let's keep going. Dang. Lost the tracks. Looks like the trail ends here. We lost her? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? We'll go with the bait. Arthur? Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Stamina is now increased to level 5. Now we wait. You say? More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. <laughs> Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. It's gonna be gone already. We had here. Got your knife? Shit. Oh snap. Not too close. Dang. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. It's nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Oh, snap. I guess we might be doing that later on. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you going to track that monster? Well, you coming or not? I'm coming with you. <laughs> Let's get going then. Come back and get that beer. I think we need a better weapon though. Because that little revolver we got. <laughs> what did we shoot like six, eight times? Well, 
Let's see if Dutch gives us any crap about disappearing like that. I don't need another. We gotta be out there making money speech. We were just out scoping a lead. He doesn't need to know it was a big furry one. Well, thanks, Arthur. I probably owe you one. Don't worry about it. I need to head out to Emerald Ranch soon, look into something. See you later. Mission completed. Alright, so we did two missions, guys. I'm gonna end the episode right here. Um, after we play a little short game of dominoes. Sure. So where did you learn to play? Saloons. Dives growing up. By eight, I was playing piano every night in a cat house. <laughs> really? And weren't no life for a child, but... I learned a few things. Target score block game. So I wonder if this is the game where you have to play by fives. So we got a six and a two. Let's block that six. Pass. Gotcha. All right, so she doesn't have twos or fours. We're gonna get rid of some ink and play that five four. Three two. We don't have any threes. Hope she doesn't have any one, so we're able to. I think not so long ago, we were freezing to death on top of a mountain. <laughs> yeah. Back at it with them sixes. Let's get rid of them. One. Oh, heck yeah. We're going to win. Domino. Yep. Arthur has played all the tiles and wins. Not much. <laughs> see you later. Let me see. Okay. Let's see if we can find a place to take a bath or change clothes. I'm short. Get lost. Well, oh, I'll go try someone with a heart. You do that. Damn it, Pearson. Good morning. Glad to be off that mountain, Mr. Pearson. Yes, indeed. Lots to do now. Yeah, for all of us. No, that's the butcher. What's the cross? Like, no, nobody's in their stations. I just wanted to say, I'm sorry about your husband, your home. He was worth a hundred of you thieves and murderers. I have no doubt. Sorry, my lady. Why don't 
don't you just sit down? Because I need to take a bath. Or a cowboy shower. Something. I got all this mud all over me. You ladies don't reckon you can give me a little bath? You did good in town. Finding out about that train. Thank you. It was fun. Well, I wouldn't say it was all fun. Can I wash up here? Top up water in the wash bin, huh? Where's the wash bin? Might be that question mark there. Why don't you sit, Arthur? You okay, Arthur? I guess. He seemed kind of worried. Of course I'm worried. What about? Let's get out of here, boy. I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Oh, it might be the X found it. It populated. <laughs> what the heck? Did you guys see that on the bucket? Good morning. Good morning, Lenny. It's got like a like a small mirror or some chicken. I don't know what that symbol is. Thank you, Mr. Morgan, for sparing me like that. I'll work hard. I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. Just see that I do. Oh, you will, boy. Thank you for saving my life. Well, yeah, of course. Arthur? I don't know, guys. I'm going to have to do some more exploring, but this is a good area to end the episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you in the next one.